Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name's David and this is a Magic Review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys so much for being here. It's getting closer, right? We're getting closer and closer to Christmas. It's pretty cool, pretty exciting. Got a massive, huge, humongous giveaway going on this Monday, doing a parlor magic giveaway. Whoever wins this is going to have multiple parlor shows available to them. The box is worth over $900. It's pretty incredible. So I hope you've taken the moment to like, subscribe, and follow this channel. I don't want you guys to miss out on all the free stuff. We're even doing a giveaway on New Year's Day. That's right. We're going to keep the party rolling. Keep the party rolling. Pretty cool. Hey, today we're looking at the coaster from Terry Chow and TCC Magic. What is the coaster? The coaster is a uh, utility that will allow you to do uh, coin through table without a table. Well, I mean, you'll have a table, but you won't, the coin won't go through your table. It'll go through the coaster. So uh, you'll have a handful of coins, say like four quarters or four half dollars, and uh, you'll have a tumbler, like a glass tumbler. You'll put the coaster on top and then one by one, you will take, you know, in your first round, you'll have four coins and slam them. One coin will drop through. Now one coin will be in the tumbler. You'll pick up three coins, slam them. One coin will drop through. It's a full four phase routine. You could do it that way, or you could do it with four different coins, right? One silver, one copper, one larger, one Canadian, right? And you could do them that way. Uh, so they'll teach you uh, a trick with all four of the same coin, and then they'll teach you a trick with all four different coins. So let's say you go to TCC Magic and you pay your $35. What are you going to get? Uh, you're going to get this flat paper box that says the coaster. And uh, obviously, as you'd expect, there's a coaster inside, right? No money. There's no money inside. You will need to provide your own coins. You're also going to get a nice little velvet bag that'll house your utility device. And really that's what this is, right? This is a utility. Notice it has a velvet surface on this side, which is great for performance. And also when you put coins on there, keeps them from sliding around, right? They should stay uh, in place a little bit because this kind of acts like a card mat. This side has more of a, just a generic paperback. And as you can see, it's got a beautiful wood finish. And again, this is, this is a utility, right? This is a utility that will enable you to do several magic tricks. The download itself is only 13 minutes. So they're just roughly going to show you how the utility works. So right off the top, I would say, you know, who would like this or who is it for? I think this is for coin workers. If you're already a coin magician, you do intermediate work, you do bar work, right? Uh, you're in restaurants where they would use a coaster, or maybe you're going to have this coaster lying at your house and you're familiar with a lot of coin slights already, I think this is a utility that you might want to examine. And let's just say it again, there's no coins included, right? No coins included. And that is another reason why I would say, or at least advise, that this, is be, this be a trick that only an intermediate coin magician picks up. Because I think if you are a beginner and you got this, and then you realize, oh wait, I need a special coin, You'd, you'd say, well, I don't have those special coins. Whereas somebody who's done coin magic for a while, they probably have a little collection of different coins that they use. And I don't mind saying what the coins are because it's already in the ad copy. The ad copy tells you very plainly, look, to do one of these tricks, you're going to need a magnetic coin, at least one magnetic coin. Um, to do the other trick, you need ferrous coins. Uh, ferrous coins would be regular coins, but Typically, they're coins from other countries that are not magnetic, but their core is such that they are attracted to magnets. There's a difference between being a magnetic coin, right, or being a coin that is attracted to magnetics. So attracted to magnets, that's ferrous. So either one or the other. And like I said, if you're an intermediate magician, you've probably got a few of those lying around the house. All right, so I said the teaching was 13 minutes. How's it shot? It's pretty much just one steady table shot, kind of just at table height. They're going to run through a routine with commentary, and they're just going to slow it down for you. Really, in, the, in that 13 minutes, they only have enough time to just go through two routines, you know, pretty much almost at speed. So it's a little slowed down. 
Um, the first routine is taught up to the seven minute mark. And the second routine uses the uh, attracted coins to the magnets. And pretty much both routines are just simply a four stage coin to glass routine. Angles are good. I think uh, you should be fine with them. They're, they, they cover, uh, you know, how you keep things hidden, right? Because you do need to keep things hidden. I guess you could flash, but I think the routines are built in such a way that uh, you, you shouldn't flash. The coaster is pretty large, right? Unless you're <laughs> doing something completely wrong. Uh, nobody should see your coins. Uh, as far as it being examinable, I think so. I, I don't think uh, people are gonna expect its magical secret. So, uh, you know, I, I, I think they can be casually inspected. Um, slice and difficulty level, like I was saying earlier, how hard is this? The slides in this come fast and loose, right? So the video is only 13 minutes, they do not slow down. So again, I would say this is probably for someone who's already familiar with coin magic and who knows uh, a good amount of coin slides and has some coin gaffs lying around. All right, so what are the positives? I think the positives are it, it, having the props definitely help the magic tricks feel different. You know, instead of having just four coins in your hand and you have nothing else and you're just doing a coins across or coins to pocket or, you know, having coins on the table and doing a coins across, adding the extra elements helps this trick feel more memorable, right? Oh, this trick uses a glass. This trick uses a coaster, right? There's no way a coin can go through a coaster, right? No. And then you do it four times, right? So I think just this one little prop, because anybody could find a coaster or a glass tumbler in a restaurant or a bar, just adds another layer. And uh, it's certainly, uh, because of the gimmick that's involved, it certainly adds, you know, a little bit more of a impossible factor to it. Negatives, of course, you know, like I said earlier, the video just felt rushed, felt fast, probably could have been slowed down, probably could have given you just a little bit more teaching. You know, like I always say, video is free. Video is free. Just shoot longer, record more, throw in some extra tips, you know, anything. Hold, hold their hand a little bit longer. But yeah, $35 at TCC Magic. TCC's killing it lately. They got a lot of great things done at their channel. Definitely want to head on down to TCC Magic. Thanks to them for allowing me to have this so I could do the review for you. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Hey, can I have just a few more minutes of your time, please? Um, I've got something important that I really want to talk to you about. Normally at the end of these videos, I use this space to promote myself, right? I tell you to subscribe uh, to my channel or I tell you to become a member of my channel or I uh, try to sell you a t-shirt or I ask you to join the member section. And lately, I've just been feeling it on my heart that I wanna use this space to promote another magician and to ask you to support his channel. So Daniel Madison, I'm sure you know, he is uh, just an incredible magician, an amazing uh, card mechanic. He's been producing magic, uh, teaching us all magic, putting out high quality cards and uh, merchandise for a really long time. He has an incredible YouTube channel. It's absolutely incredible. Um, I don't know if you've visited lately. He does really fun little shorts, beautiful editing, great shots, amazing music. His most recent video was a magic tutorial. He teaches you the snap change. He spends 30 minutes. It is a 30 minute masterclass on the snap change and it's free. Out of all the magic channels that are out there, whether they're reviewers or performers or teachers, Daniel Madison deserves to be in everyone's top three. He, he deserves to be in everyone's top three. He, he, is my, he is my number one, my number one, hands down, okay? And I would love for him to get the recognition that I think he deserves, not just from us as a community, but also from YouTube for the great videos he puts out. If you've not yet subscribed to Daniel Madison, if you have not yet pushed that subscribe button, you're not the kind of person that subscribes to, to a lot of channels, I get it. But if you appreciate Daniel Madison and you appreciate the art, or at least you can appreciate his effort and his drive and his game, I would highly ask you to go over to his channel really quick, hit that subscribe button. Let's bump Daniel Madison up to 100K. I wanna see him hit 100K. I wanna see him make the video where he gets his plaque. I think he's so deserving of it. And like I said, Daniel Madison, his channel, 
my top 10, easily in my top 10, because he's my number one. He's my number one. Thank you guys so much for listening. I'll see you next time. Bye.